hey guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm going to be installing a wig that was previously installed um i think i got this professionally installed in july and it's now october so basically when i took it off i didn't do anything with it so i just grabbed it and i just put it on my head so the baby hairs are still formed and everything so if you want to see me reapply this wig then keep watching so i will signature sent me three lace tint mousse um, the colors are deep dark brown um, they have medium dark brown and dark brown so in this video i'm going to be demonstrating how i use it and how efficient and quick the process of tinting your lace can be So as y'all see, this is not a new wig. This is literally a wig that I just pulled from my pile of wigs. Um, and yeah, excuse the braids. I kind of just took um, a wig off probably the day before this. So yeah. So I'm taking my medium dark brown lace tint mousse and I'm using a small little brush to just kind of comb it in the lace. And then I'm going to take my blow dryer on um, a low heat setting and I'm just going to make sure it's dry. So as I'm putting this wig on, I'm thinking like, oh my God, it's no way that this wig is about to come out right. But I was just like, let me just trust the process. So I pulled the hair away from my face just so I could see and I pulled out the crunchy edges. Yes, they were crunchy, but you know, we're gonna fix that. I'm gonna be using the even glue. Um, I know people have so many biases towards the glue you're supposed to use, but this is just what I use. I have graduated from using the ghost bond um, just because it was too high and it just wasn't really doing it for me. So I used two coats of glue as you can see and no I didn't blow dry it I just kind of let it air dry for like literally a minute. <laughs>
I'm pulling out the hairs once again, but I'm also trying to like comb the lace into the glue so it can last and hold. Now I'm using my Gotta Be Glue Free Spray. I don't care what y'all say about this stuff. I love it. After that, I am going to be taking my elastic band. No, it's not. This hair is not from this company. I just bought a whole pack of these from Amazon. Um, yeah, so don't get no ideas. What, what does that say? I don't even know. But yeah, the hair is not from there. I'm literally so impatient. I think I let that stay on for a good two minutes and now I am basically just hot combing uh, the hair back just so I can, um, you know, pay attention to the baby hairs for now. So I know everything escalated pretty fast, but the goal for this hairstyle is a half up, half down. So what I did was um, off camera, I kind of like detangled the front, removed the middle part, and now I am attempting to put it in a ponytail. I put the band back on because I was really pulling it tight because I like my ponytails to be like really gripped. Um, yeah, and I didn't want the lace lifting. So I put that back on and I finally got a somewhat ponytail, but you know, me, I'm gonna fix it because I'm a perfectionist. So. So now we're moving on to the actual baby hairs. Now I am still to this day struggling. Um, I love how the hairstylists do their baby hairs, but for the life of me, I cannot figure it out. Um, I think it's because they have like that little skinny one that they use to like curl it 
and I don't have that. I'm gonna get it, but I don't got it yet. So I am using the I Will Lace Tint Mousse and they sent me this stuff and I absolutely love it because what it does is it tints your lace. So I got frustrated here because I had no mirror in front of me. I was just looking at the viewfinder on my camera and it was so small. So I got up and I went to the restroom to fix my baby hair, it's basically. So I am back and this is how we are looking. Yes, I wet my hair. Yes, I took the ponytail out and put it back in because I wanted it to look neat. And this is where we're at. Um, this looks great. Like I did that, period. Period, ah, period, uh. So I didn't film an outro because I really didn't have anything left to say, but thank you guys for watching. If you want more videos like this, be sure to subscribe and like this video.